totally found Michael's hat. <laughs> Can you guess which one? <laughs> I wish. Today I'm at our local Goodwill. Today is Sunday and the only thrift stores that open are the Goodwills. Um, they should have some new stuff. It's been about three to four days since we've been here last. Um, let's get inside and see what we can find to resell on eBay. All right, today is a happy day. The sun is out. Let me take a look at this. It's an Egyptian head. It's made of resin. It's kind of cool for $15.99. Oh, here's one of those, um, the blue sky. I'm pretty sure that's blue sky. Yep, Heather Goldman. Um, $20. This is a larger one. Let me put it down, it's heavy. Oh, look, it has a cat. Ooh, look at them. Look at the vines going up. Spring blossom. Might have to look that up. Um, I think $20 is um, not enough room for us to resell. World of Whimsy. Oh, 1994. I like them. Is that a carrot? <laughs> Look at this mask. Aztec for $30. I wonder how much more I could get for that. It's definitely hand carved, hand painted. Hmm. This is a larger one in more detail. Oh, look at the teeth. That's pretty cool. I'm not sure about $30. <laughs> See if that's Waterford. Um, score him. That's pretty. Resin. It's a pottery bowl for $4.99. Um, Norway. I think because it says Norway. Um, I'm going to get it for $4.99. It's a pretty design. It goes in the cart. I have to make sure there's no chips on it before I check out. <laughs> Ooh, look at this peacock. I was hoping it was a ceramic. It's a plastic for $10. That's pretty. I always like um, peacocks. What about this vase back here? Ah, ooh. Hold on. I feel like the base is going to come off. Um, is that to a lamp? Did somebody make that into a lamp? I wish I could see the bottom of the vase. That's, let me see if that's hand painted. It's definitely hand painted. I wonder if it's um, Lennox Balik. $16.99. I mean, if someone made it into, they drilled a hole in the bottom. That definitely ruined the, um, the value. Check that out. Ooh, that's pretty. Is that a glass or... First I thought it was a votive. Let me see if there's a signature. I don't see one. I kind of like that for $2. Let me put that in and... Yeah, it's only $2. Ooh, look at this lady with um sand. There's probably a certain name for that. It's $12.99. It's a little bit different. I don't know, about $12.99 though. It looks like uh, made in Japan. Ten dollars for the set. They're on barrels. You get the sugar creamer teapot. Um, this I feel like it would only sell about like twenty, twenty-five dollars. Let me see if these plastic bowls are um, Texas ware. Um, it just says USA. Um, Scranton, Pennsylvania. Um. If it was a little bit older, like the Texas wear, I would get that. That's pretty. Definitely newer from, I don't know, Marshalls or... Hey, what about this egg? It feels like um, rubber for a dollar. <laughs> Restaurant wear. Um, Stoneware made in Japan. Take a look at this teacup. Oh, greatest tea wear. I know some of her stuff can sell. Most of it, no. 
bell flower. I probably looked at that. What's this enamel? Usually when I find these, they're Burton and Burton for $4.99, silver plated. I'm not sure about that. Let me take a look at this clear and satin stem glass. I want to see if it's Lilique. Oh, I can already tell but just by feeling it. <laughs> it's nice though. There's this Holly Berry set down here. I want to see if it's Fitz and Floyd. I'm um, Christmas tree shop. That's nice for a Christmas tree shop. Let me see about this angel. You were special. You are special. Jeez. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's just like a, a made in China gift. And what about this picture back here? The uh, eagle. Let me um, peel that and see what it says. National Gallery of Art. For, it has the original price tag for a dollar. Oh my gosh. Now it's five ninety nine. <laughs> This is a crystal, carved crystal um, lighthouse. Um, continental crafted in Taiwan for $5.99. Here's a made in Spain handmade bowl, um, probably from Marshalls. All right, I made it to the white section. Um, it doesn't look like anything really new except this. These white glasses. That's um Fire King. You can see the F in the or um you can see the F in the shield. Okay, let me take a look at the Ray Dawn. We have the chocolate chips for $7.99. And that is definitely newer. I'll pick it up if it's older. It's TJ Maxx. <laughs> this vase. I thought maybe it was Lennox. And it has a hole on the bottom. Let's see about this pottery. Pretty tell it's newer. Made in China. I mean, that's, I like that. It's nice. It has the uh, three different sizes and the glaze. Let's take a look at the lamps. I see a lot of brass. Oh, here's a uh, pottery for $20. Let me see if this is signature. There's one down there. Hmm. I think I might get that. For twenty dollars, a pottery lamp. I think that's pretty enough, and it, if it doesn't sell for a lot, I'll keep it for myself. Let's see about this lamp. Oh, I like that. Look at the shade. Looks like um nineteen sixties, fifties. Um, it looks like a brass. Oh, it's spray painted. This is broken off and it's $30. Um, and then the inside is broken out. All right, I'm gonna leave that. It is pretty though. If it was in better condition, I would pick that up maybe for myself. <laughs> I always like these bunk cake pans, especially the orange. I feel like this has been here for months. Look how awesome this is. I wish there was a pear. read that. It's too much of a glare. Deep. It's probably a souvenir. <laughs> um, I always take a look in the silver. See if there's any sterling. It's newer. All right, I'm not seeing anything over here. Wait, Bombay is good. About ten dollars, though it's for wine. Hey, look at this embroidered um, tablecloth. Ooh, that's nice. It has the uh, flowers. Let me see how much that is. Let me see this price tag. Uh, twenty dollars. Ooh, I think I could do twenty on that. <laughs> Probably get like thirty dollars for it. And then this is pretty. Look at the daisies. It's a curtain. We just have one panel though. 
Yeah, if there was two, I wonder if that's for the kitchen. Probably is. Look at this lemon, I mean orange dish. Olivia tree made in Italy for $4.99. I think I'll do that, that's nice. Put that in. This, this brand um, always sells for us, so whenever I see that, I just pick it up. I'll look it in a kitchen. Oh, look at this cat. Made in China cat. <laughs> Let me see what this is. Oh, Capitamonte for $3.99. Um, let me see if there are, all the petals are there and leaves. Um, I see some leaves missing and petals. I have to leave it. I can't pick up um, damaged items. Oh, that's a resin. It's not expecting that Nantucket. Let me just see if this is a uh, Scentsy. I wonder if that's on um, Yankee Candle. See, so you have all the Yankee Candle tarts. That is not Yankee Candle. Yeah, it is. For $10, I'm gonna leave that. Oh, I think that's Dunkin' Donuts. I thought it was um, Starbucks. <laughs> Okay. Actually, I don't think the Starbucks um, City mugs are selling as well as like a couple years ago. I gotta research that a little more. It's been a while. Okay, so I came back to the mask. I did a little research. Someone has it listed for 180 on eBay. I looked on Worth Point and there's no sold. So I can't spend $30 on that. Kind of want it though. <laughs> There's a wedding gown, brand new. Oh, I can't. I'm just gonna go in there and um, feel it. All right, I forgot to take a look at this vase. Let me put the flowers over there. I just, is that a signature? Oh no, I just realized it's painted on the inside and a lot of it is scratched. I still like it though. Right, let me put the flowers back in there. There we go. <laughs> Alright, I haven't really been looking in the pictures and the plaques. What about that? Friends or Angels. Oh, kind of looks like um, the TV show Friends with the purple and green. <laughs> Ooh, it is signed. Um, $9. Let me see about that. That looks like glass. Ooh. Is there anything in the art? Oh, there's that, um... I already forgot what it's called. Spill paint? I can't remember. For $5.99. Look, they even added, um, texture on there. It's kind of neat. It almost looks like a beach. The ocean. I totally found Michael's hat. <laughs> Can you guess which one? <laughs> well, I wish he was here to try it on. All right, I've looked around about four times. I'm not seeing anything else. This is everything we're getting. I'm trying to wonder if I should try doing an auction on eBay for some of this stuff, especially this one. And that. Okay, I'm gonna go check out. All right, so my total spend was $34. I'm excited about that lamp. Um, I did a little bit of research on eBay and someone has it listed for $120, I believe, 100 or 120. So I'm gonna list mine for a little bit cheaper, probably 80, 80, 85. Um, and I'm gonna do some of these items on eBay as an auction. Um, I want all of our viewers to have first dibs. So I'm gonna do the art glass, votive, I believe this is a votive, it's not a cup. Um, I'm gonna start that out at $6 and I'm gonna do the made in Italy orange dish. I'm gonna start that out at six. And then the Norway bowl, I'm gonna start at $6. So I'm gonna go home and try to list some of these items and we have to catch up on our bookkeeping. We're two weeks behind. <laughs> so I'm gonna go home and work and I'll see everybody next time, bye. 
All right, I'm just gonna show everybody a little haul of some items that we got from an auction and um, some other thrift stores. I bought certain things online also. Let's start with these. These are Josef Originals. Um, we got these at Salvation Army. We have two more upstairs that we're gonna do in the live auction with Avon Thrifty Rich this Wednesday at 8 p.m. Eastern time. So we're gonna do a couple of those, but look, you have this one. I think that word means um, stupid or something. I can't remember, <laughs> um, but that one is cute. Then you have this one, the doctor it says RX, and you have the sticker on the bottom. This one is cute. Little um, mouse taking a bath. And it says Japan on the bottom. We have the little pig. Looks like he's flexing. I thought that was kind of neat. Then we have another one upstairs. Um, I can't remember what they're doing. This one is just a Lefton made in Taiwan. So it is a little bit newer, probably from 1980s. Uh, all right, and then these little furry friends here. We have this cute um, cat or a lion, tiger, I don't know. Um, but these are made in Japan. You have the fur on the top of the head. I've, it feels like real fur, to tell you the truth. I wonder if it's rabbit fur. But I thought those were cute. I spent $20 for four of them. That was including shipping. They have this one. It's the cutest one out of all of them. Oh, I just noticed there was a name on it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Norcrest, and then you have the bow only on one of the ears. I wonder if I could clean that. I don't know if that's dust or the color of the fur. But I love the anthrop anthropomorphic figurines. They have this one with a hat. They still have to be clean. I didn't do anything with them. And this one is the goofiest. <laughs> it's supposed to have more fur, but it looks funny with just one string of hair. <laughs> I might keep this one for myself. And then this, I just want to show it again. I found this at Salvation Army. I believe I showed it in the video. This is Eldrith Pottery 2002 Redware. Um, this one is a little more rare to find. I only spent $2 and there was a sold comp on Worth Point for over $100. I believe we have ours listed for $85 or $100, but it has the hand painted right there with a the yellow and it's on the handle and on the edge and has some detail around the outside so I thought that was kind of neat oh this one is kind of cool Michael found this at Goodwill this is a Whiting and Davis bag mesh bag let me open it up you can see the inside see the tag is folded over so I don't think Goodwill saw that I think he spent $6 or $10 on this. Now, for my research, you could tell the age by looking at the tag. This one is from 1940s. And for some reason, when I look at this, I feel like it's 1980s. <laughs> I don't know about anybody else. But we have that listed. It's a little different with the, um, the metal hanging on the bottom. All right, and on this, I'm trying not to make too much noise with it. We have case glass. This is antique Victorian. Um, I got this from an online auction in a lot, but you have the bee right there, the insect, and then all of this enamel detail that I love. It is um, repaired right here. See it in the light. Um, it's not a bad repair. I can't really notice it if it's like on a shelf. I wish there was something on the other side. But I can't remember how much we have this listed for. <laughs> and, oh, let me show these. I didn't show them in the last video. These are uranium glass candle holders. It has the uh, gold around the edge. Of course, some of the gold is worn. There's the bottom, but I like the way they sit. They're kind of like a umbrella or a mushroom. 
I'm gonna review everything that we have for auction on our eBay store. Thus, the Norway Bowl is made by Ellie. Uh, what was the last name? Um, Karmic? I think I'm saying that right, but the E, that's supposed to be L-L-E, Norway. Starting that at $8. It's worth um, in the mid $20 range. And then we have the Made in Italy Viet tree, um, the oranges, and the basket. Um, it does have a little bit of residue there. I tried getting it out with rubbing alcohol. You could probably use the um, Gooby Gone, but I don't want to um, wash these away because I like the pads underneath it. That I started out at $8. This awesome art class, votive. It's not a cup, even though you could use it as a cup. Um, I started this out at $6, but it almost has that end of the day look to it. But end of the day would be um, a bunch of colors mixed together, but that's what it looks like. And then you have the swirl design and a little bit of iridescent and a lot of bubbling. So you know it's hand blown and you have the Pontal on the bottom. So everything on eBay is listed except these furry friend figurines. They may or may not be on our eBay um, store by the time this video comes out because it's right now it's really late. Um, but the rest is listed and the auction, even the little bunny that we got the other day is listed. Now some people have this listed as Ellie Smith. Is that an L? It looks like an L. Um, I don't know. I'm going by what people have it listed on eBay for. They're saying it's Ellie Smith, but I'm just unsure about it. So we got that listed, I believe, for $14. Okay, I think that is it for tonight. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Check out our eBay store and make sure to join us this Wednesday with Yvonne Thrifty Rich at 8 p.m. Eastern Time for our live sale. We're going to pick out some cool items, probably some of these. All right, I'll see everybody next time. Bye!